Hey guys, Kangaskid18 here, and I'm back for another round of shiny speculation for the upcoming Pokémon Sun and Pokémon Moon. We got spoiled yet again this morning as they revealed a whole slew of new Pokémon, including two that were first revealed in this month's Koro Koro. Last time as many Pokémon were revealed, I wasn't crazy about many of the designs, but I gotta say, this time around, I really love what I'm seeing. Without further ado, let's get started with the first of these new Pokémon, Wimpod. Of the Pokémon that were revealed today, Wimpod is probably my favorite. It looks like it's based off a tadpole shrimp, also known as a Triops. I'm a huge fan of Pokémon based off real-life animals, and Wimpod does not disappoint. Now while I'm a huge fan of Wimpod, I had a little trouble coming up with a shiny for it, so I've got a couple of possibilities here. For the first one, I've changed the light blue to more of a teal green, and the purple mouth and tail have become yellow. I made the eyes a light blue to avoid clashing with the new yellow color, and overall I really like this one. Even if it does look a little too much like the suit from Kick-Ass. Anyway, for the second shiny, I wanted to go a totally different direction. So if Wimpole is based off a tadpole shrimp, I thought, why not make it look more like a shrimp? So now everything's become pink, with a kind of darker pink for the trim. Add some yellow highlights, top it off with some cool red eyes, and I think we've got a great shiny. Next up, we've got a new grass-type Pokémon, Bound Sweep. Now let me tell you why I like Bound Sweep. The design is super simple, but at the same time, it's fully formed. You can tell exactly what it is. It's some kind of berry, or perhaps a half-open macadamia nut. Either way, I love this design, and I love it shiny. What I did here was change the pink color to a nice green, kind of like what they did with Hopip shiny. But I couldn't get the leaves to look a good color until I stumbled upon this nice mellow purple that seemed to work really well. If the shiny ends up looking anything close to this, I'll be happy. Continuing on, we've got a new Grass Fairy-type Pokémon, Comfey. Oh wait, did I say grass? I meant just fairy. Damn it, Game Freak! Why do you keep giving us these fairy types that should clearly be part grass? Anyway, Comfey is based off a of Hawaiian Lay, and I'm certain it's going to learn a whole bunch of grass-type attacks, despite lacking the type. I'm not super crazy about its design, but boy do I love its shiny. Instead of a whole bunch of different colored flowers, all the flowers on Comfey's Lay have become blue and white. I don't know why, but I really like the look of these colors together. Then to accentuate Comfey's soul fairy typing, I made its body pink and purple. I'm sure nobody from Game Freak watches my videos, but gosh darn it, they better watch this one. Because I want Comfey's shiny to look exactly like this, because nothing else will be anywhere as good. Next we've got kind of a random Pokémon, it's Mudsdale, the ground-type, enormous horse Pokémon. Mudsdale's design is okay, but it just kind of seems random to have a big ol' horse on these tiny Hawaiian islands. Anyway, as random as Mudsdale seems to be, its shiny is also pretty random. Instead of being brown and black, it turns into a light green and a darker green, with some nice blue highlights. I told you it was random, but this shiny could end up looking pretty cool in-game. The next Pokémon revealed today was actually one we'd seen earlier this month in Koro Koro. It's Mimikyu. Mimikyu has been the subject of all sorts of memes recently. It's apparently a ghost that haunts an old piece of Pokémon merchandise because it wants to be as popular as Pikachu was. People really seem to like this design, but I just don't get it. I mean, it looks okay, but it doesn't grab me the way some of the others do. It just kind of seems super random. That being said, I think there's only one possible shiny for it. If Mimikyu wants to be a Pikachu so bad, its shiny has obviously got to be that of shiny Pikachu. I wouldn't be surprised if this ends up being Mimikyu's actual shiny, but I could also see Game Freak going a totally different direction with it. Finally, we've got the second Pokémon revealed in Koro Koro this month, Beware. It's a giant red panda Pokémon that apparently loves to hug people to death. Initially, I wasn't crazy about this design, but over time I've been able to see the red panda aspects more and more, and now I kind of like it. Anyway, on to the shinies. The first thing that popped into my mind when I saw Beware was to make the whole thing yellow. I don't know why, but I think it really works here, and I'd like to see something similar. However, I did make a second shiny for this one. If Beware is based off a of red panda, then why not make it shiny colors based off a of giant panda? Instead of pink and black, now it's white and black, and it gets this cute pink nose. I definitely wouldn't mind if they went this direction with it shiny. Anyway guys, that's all I've got for you today. Keep an eye out for a new video coming soon, and as always guys, we are going to see you on the next Shiny.